I thought you should see this. While scanning for threats in the area, we found a body. That's unfortunate, but probably not surprising these days. What makes this one unusual? It's a well-known Gotham entrepreneur. Maybe you've heard of him. Bru yeah. The name rings a bell. This isn't the real Bruce Wayne. At least not the one from our world. He Are you sure? He could have been corrupted. Like Superman. I've been updating Batman. He knows Wayne very well. Jim, I reached Bruce Wayne. He's fine. I've verified his identity to my satisfaction. Oh, that's good enough for me. But I'd still like to know how this version came to be here. You're not the only one. Let me know what you find. Male, Caucasian, 30s. Excellent physical condition. Aside from the obvious. Cause of death isn't hard. Ugh, his face is a mess. Yes, but the disfigurement on half of his face took place some time ago. Several days at least. The fatal injury was a skull fracture, caused by a blow from a blunt object. Guys had a bad week. Expensive clothes? No surprise. Oh, that watch is worth a small fortune, so... Robbery wasn't the motive. Based on the blood spatter, he was wearing this when he was killed. I would estimate the time of death as being within the past 10 hours. I agree. Based on liver mortis, algor mortis, and rigor mortis. I have to admit, I'm impressed. Amazons do not rely solely upon magic, Commissioner. We've got company. Someone's listening in. Let's break this up and follow him back to wherever he came from. I'll take the victim back to headquarters for a full autopsy. We'll check the immediate area for any further clues. Hey, our admirer's leaving. You get a look at what he's carrying? Yes, a crowbar. Also known as a blunt object. Uh, give him just enough of a lead so he uh, feels safe.
Great oh, yeah. Yeah. Is mine. Let them try. The dead Bruce Wayne is from the other place, the Dark Multiverse, they call it. The boss, not Joker, the, the new guy, wanted him to find your Bruce Wayne, kill him, and take his place. I mean, come on, rich dude like that he could do a lot to help take over the world. If he was helping you guys, why kill him? I told you, I didn't. We didn't. He went missing. They sent me to find him. But you found him first. Where did he disappear from? Wayne Tech, Los Angeles. There's an apartment there for, for Bruce Wayne to use when he's in town. Okay. Go to the GCPD building. Gordon's expecting you. He'll keep you safe. Batman, we're at Wayne Tech, Los Angeles. The Jokers are here. Looks like they can't get into your private quarters. Without Bruce Wayne's retina and fingerprints, they wouldn't be able to. We don't have those things either. Deal with the Jokers. By the time you're done, I'll have a solution. Great Point me at the target. Mine. Let them try. Strange. This iron appears recently used, but the closet is full of perfectly pressed clothing. Still in dry cleaner bags. Ah. The substance on the iron is... burned skin. The dark Bruce Wayne was disfigured with it. Ugh. That's nasty. But there are no signs of a struggle. No bloodstains indicating he was killed here. He's talking to an Alfred. Uh, hmm. He was surprised by the sophistication of our Bruce Wayne's security. Sounds like this Bruce wasn't also Batman. He was getting help from Alfred trying to hack our Bruce's systems. But I don't see any sign that he succeeded. This is fascinating. Alfred seems to be speaking to two different people. One is angry and eager to help the Dark Legion. The other appears reluctant. You're right. Here, Alfred tells Bruce what he did was foolish. He only hurt himself. With everything that's going on, Alfred says no one will be surprised to see that Bruce Wayne sustained a disfiguring injury. And Bruce disfigured himself to sabotage his mission to replace our Bruce. But why? Okay. These chats show Bruce was really committed to his mission. He's excited about punishing everyone, especially all the, uh... <clears throat> rich, fat cats who look down on people like me. That's odd. 
Our Bruce has been rich his entire life. Ah, uh, I think this one was too. Uh, here's something interesting. Uh, every now and then, Bruce refers to himself as Joe. Alfred has to remind him he's Bruce Wayne. We appear to be coming away with more questions than answers.